Hey everybody, I am in Union Springs, Alabama, and uh, been checking out some of the cool stuff. Uh, let's see, there's a building right there, it's called Josephine's Cafe. It's a cafe, but above, upstairs, the whole thing back in the early 1800s. As a matter of fact, I think it was exactly the year 1800. It was a hotel at one time, and uh, now they conduct ghost tours and everything up there. That, pretty cool so they gave me a bunch of brochures and stuff I'm thinking uh, one of these times I come back here because I come here a lot I just never really explored so I'm just kind of walking around taking photos and getting to meet kind of the townspeople kind of unique and uh, here's their old cemetery I'm gonna go ahead and walk through it right now I could do it without dropping the camera but uh, really unique town so far like I said they do the ghost tour so I'm thinking I might, I might jump in on that one day uh, probably maybe on my next trip here uh, we pick up chicken here quite a bit so today would be a perfect day I don't I don't pick up until midnight tonight but to do a ghost tour I'm sure those things last a lot longer past midnight and I got to head up to Minnesota uh, this is kind of unique. You know what, let's go try and find the oldest headstone in the cemetery. I always enjoy doing that. Uh, where to start? I've passed quite a few already. Let's, uh, there's a gate right here. Let's walk in this gate. This here might be old. Because it looks like some of them you can't even read. Uh, this here is... I can't even read the name on the gate. Okay, this big one is his wife. It says wife on it. Let's walk around the other side. I don't want to step on somebody's grave. It feels kind of weird to me. Oh, while walking around, let's see if we could read this one. April 16, 1810. It's kind of old. I don't see nothing on these brick ones. Okay, let's go in here. This here says here. W.S. Madison, three hand daughters of... So these are all daughters. January 15th, 1824. Died the 25th. 1856, 32 years old. Yeah, they didn't live too long back in the 1800s. This one's kind of off kilter. It always freaks me out. Eighteen sixty-two. Yeah, I can see why they have ghost tours around here. It's kind of a scary little town. I mean, I did I did walk down Main Street. I was looking for photographs, you know, things that uh, I was sure it's hard to hold this with one hand and paperwork all at the same time. And yeah, maybe that'll do it. But uh, what was I saying? I walked I walked down Main Street. It, it's it's really cool. Um, I guess there was three fires in town throughout the town's history and destroyed quite a bit of stuff but this here is like the oldest section we got uh, as I turn the camera again an old log cabin here and an old well but oh whoa here we go that well has a letter on it green thumb garden club and it looks like an X to me Hold on one second, guys. Okay, Glass. Take a picture. Okay, yeah, that, that looks like an X. Actually, a really good X. For Explorer. <laughs> anyway, I just kind of wanted to uh, walk around here. Let's see, this is all locked up. Yeah, there's locks on it. Yeah, 
Okay, maybe on the front. Let's go check out the front. They have to have some sort of museum. The um, haunted hotel slash um, diner had an art museum inside that was kind of neat. Here, let me walk around. You don't need to be looking at my ugly mug the whole time anyway. Hope we're allowed to be over here. I did talk to the police and they said I can explore the whole city. They got a lot of Victorian homes here that uh, are for sale. Some really nice ones. And they're only like $55,000 for a beautiful, like, four-story Victorian home. Those are like Florida prices. Huh. Okay, let's see. Let's see what we can see in here. Ooh. I hope I don't get in trouble for this. Okay. Any spirits in here? I'm sorry. Uh, they drink Tropicana if there are. <laughs> kind of cool. I wonder if the door's open. No. Nope. Well, at least the windows have wooden hinges. Let's see what's on this side. Uh, not care if I could even open it. I'm gonna set this paperwork down here. It might be nailed shut. Yeah, it's nailed shut. Oh well. This is my exploration of Union Springs, Alabama. So I'm gonna go ahead and sign off. I have no cell phone service, so this video won't even be uploaded today, but uh, I will upload it as soon as possible. For some reason, Sprint did something weird last night. Uh, I got a text message that I went over on my roaming data. I, I pay a lot of money a month to have unlimited everything, and uh, they shut my data off for roaming last night. It was weird. So I either have to find a Wi-Fi hotspot somewhere to upload or just wait until I get normal cell phone service, which will probably be sometime tomorrow since I'm stuck here till midnight. But until then, I'm going to go ahead and uh, just walk around town and take a lot of photos and we'll talk to you all later.